I think that one of the things that's difficult is that as it's human nature, we learn from our mistakes. We learn from bad things. And with incidents of school violence, we owe it to the folks that we lost to learn and, and protect others from having that happen to them. The Sandy Hook, I think it, it showed evil knows no bounds. I mean, those were young kids. And you get to the point where you say, this is not OK. This multifaceted program will be developed by the very best experts in the field. Former Congressman Asa Hutchinson will lead the effort as national director of the National Model School Shield Program. With a budget provided by the NRA of whatever scope the task requires to hire the most knowledgeable and credentialed experts that are available in the United States of America. Under ACE's leadership, our team of security experts will make this program available to every single school in America free of charge. We had asked Asa Hutchinson, former congressman and now governor of Arkansas, to lead a task force of security experts and really take a temperature of what was happening in the schools across the nation. I took this assignment on one condition, that my team of experts will be independent and will be guided solely by what are the best security solutions for the safety of our children while at school. But this model security plan will allow every school to choose among its various components to develop a school safety strategy that fits their own unique circumstance. School security personnel will be one element of that plan, but by no means the only element. Asa Hutchinson, who's presently the governor of Arkansas, who was a U.S. attorney, the head of the Drug Enforcement Agency, and the number two man at the Department of Homeland Security. Asa brought together a group of experts to look at the best practices. What do you do to protect a facility like a school? The task force came back to us and they said, certainly there are challenges out there and we do know that there are things that we can be doing better. They spent six, nine months coming up with what they thought was the best approach to providing security for our children and that's what provided the foundations for the School Shield program.